What is going on guys? It is Renegade Gen Ninja here bringing you a gameplay back from when I first started playing the game when it first came out. I have no idea how long into the game I was this, but I was in the I was this. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, English as I'm talking about. But uh this is before I knew that the Weevil was absolute garbage. I thought it was awesome. I was like, hell yeah, this gun is the best. Then I realized it sucks more dick than the rest. Because it is terrible. I am going to use it here because I thought that, you know, having a... Normally guns that have a large magazine, yeah, they're my babies. They are my babies. But this gun, this gun is the exception. It is not my baby. It does not kill worth a crap. And I think, here's the thing about it, though. Usually when you have a gun like this, <clears throat> in Call of Duty, you either have a very large magazine or a very fast time to kill. But you can kind of mix and match. You can put a gun with a faster time to kill, and you can put extended mags on it. Or, you can put, have a gun with a large magazine and put rapid fire on it, but rapid fire in this game sucks, they made it really, really weak, which I am not opposing, that's actually okay with me, I'm just saying, I'm just giving facts, facts aren't attacks, honey, it's just what it is, and, uh, so this is back when I was running the Weevil, back in the back, back, back days, but... I still do my work with it. I'm going to give you a tip here, guys. Try to dip tip that I try to give all my peoples, even when I'm playing against them online. And that is jump. Yeah, jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down. One, two, sit down. Yeah, buddy. But you got to jump. You got to jump. That's the thing. A lot of people like to drop shot. Drop shotting's okay, but sometimes if you're shooting, someone's shooting at your chest, and you drop shot, you give them your face. Which drop shot has its 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 usefulness, but I'm not trying to say it's garbage. Not like the Weevil, Sorry. but <clears throat> jumping is amazing. They go to shoot you and you're gone. But if they do hit you, it's your toes and it doesn't kill you. And uh, a lot of times, what I like to do is jump, and then if I don't just slay them instantly, maybe I'm caught a little bit. I double jump. Lily, do not lick my fingers. I will let you sit on my lap while I commentate, but you do not lick my fingers. All right, or keep licking my fingers. You know what? You do what you want to do because you're the most gangster puppy you'll ever meet in your life. I got you. That's fine. If Lily wants to lick fingers, she's going to lick some fingers. So <clears throat> what am I going to say about it? Anyway, jumping is amazing. I will jump when uh, an enemy, when I jump, I jump around a corner if I think there's an enemy there because he's aiming right at my chest. He's ready to shoot somebody. All of a sudden, boom, all he sees is my tootsies and he can't hit me. So I go ahead and do that. Or if I get in a gunfight, if I get shot in the back, the side, even the front, the first thing I do, I'll be getting shot in the back. And first thing I do is hit that space bar or whatever it is on console i do not know and i jump and i turn on him do a complete turned on and uh blast them in the air and then a good a good thing to do is after you jump is to jump again and that's right jump again and strafe left or right in the air they you will be surprised how hard it is for these people to hit you at the end of the day instead of worrying about accuracy how good because i was telling my buddy this and he's like yeah but when i jump i have a hard time shooting him you will get better at shooting them you will get more used to shooting them if anything else, be a hard target to hit. Don't worry so much about being accurate. The accuracy will come in time. Being a hard target to hit is actually more beneficial than being perfectly accurate. Spray a little bit, but be a hard target to hit. It's a better idea. But I will jump, sometimes jumble jump, always moving left and right in the air. And then when I land, sometimes I'll go prone or slide. It just depends on how much juice I have left. Because at the meantime, you could have killed four people. You literally kill enough people that you can get a reload in and kill some more sometimes if you're that elusive, evasive, whatever. And here's the deal. That was garbage right there. My own raps killed me with my power slam because I'm using a weevil and that's the side effect of using a weevil. I'm going to blame it on the weevil. I'm going to blame every every death I'm going to blame on the weevil in this game because it's garbage. The VMP has a very large magazine. It's actually a very good choice. I recommend the VMP for anybody, especially new players. I also recommend the Vesper because it kills instantly. Brr, done. Brr, done. It's that's how the Vesper works, and it's fantastic for that. But you run out of bullets fast. The Vesper is garbage because that's the that's the word of the day right now. Is garbage. It's garbage without extended mags. You got to have extended mags in the Vesper, but that's just a little grind. You got to get that grind on there, grab that extended mags, and then you can do a little bit of work with it. It's uh, kills a little faster than the VMP, doesn't have quite the distance, I'd say. So, you know, you, you kind of got to go with what you want to play at there. Um, 
I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think of some more tips here. Actually, let's let's get off the tip bandwagon here real quick. Let's get off the tip. Oh, here's a tip. Don't use the wraps, by the way, because it's underpowered. Uh, Century gun is beast. But let's get off the tip bandwagon here. My century, my my headset's gonna beep again on me because there's no music playing to it. Hmm. Let's get off the tip bag bandwagon here. Let's get onto the bitch bandwagon. I am going to bitch about things that make me angry in this game right now. Okay, let's do it right now. First thing, all right? You know what? No, let's not. Let's save that for a whole different video. Let's talk about that stuff when I'm angry at Call of Duty. Right now, let's talk about the happy things I like in this game. I like this game. I think it has minimal lag. That's a huge deal, because Black Ops 1? Huh, huh, garbage. <laughs> used it again. Let's see how many times I can use that word. Anyway, I really like this game. It was a lot of fun. Wait, that, that one didn't even make sense. Now I just sound like a fanboy. I really like this game. It's so good. But, no, I really do. I do I actually enjoy this game. Some of my friends don't. Some of my friends get really irritated and frustrated at this game. I actually really enjoy it. Matter of fact, I wish my friends liked it more because them getting frustrated sometimes makes me frustrated because they're frustrated and then I get frustrated. But I actually really, really enjoy this game. I think it's uh, finally the Call of Duty that I've kind of been waiting for. I know that sounds really stupid and cliche, but it's true. And I really hope that a lot of people that I've, uh, a lot of people in general kind of hit their stride and really enjoy the game because I want a lot of people to play this game. And on PC, it just doesn't seem like a whole, whole lot of people play. And I know, I know, consoles will always have more people playing, but PC still had a, a pretty large crowd. And it just seems like it's really hard to find a match. And here's the thing. <sighs> It shouldn't be. It might be a glitch in the matchmaking system. I'm not sure. But a lot of times I can't play Kill Confirmed. A game, like my favorite game type is Kill Confirmed. And I can't play it because there's no one there to play it. Oh, God, Weevil, come on now. Okay, Weevil did good for me. If you're wondering what I used to record, it is Shadow Play. Fantastic program, actually. Usually with NVIDIA cards. And uh, that's why I recommend NVIDIA cards, just because of Shadow Play. I'm not sponsored by them. But, oh, my God, if I was sponsored by them, wouldn't that be fantastic? Talk about cash money. This is a very random commentary, so I'm going to go ahead and say right now, if you like commentaries, if you like Call of Duty, if you like anything to do with video games, if you like puppies, go ahead and subscribe to this channel, because I like that. Uh, like the video if you did enjoy. Hey, if you didn't enjoy, that's okay. Give me a dislike and tell me in the comments below why you didn't like it. I like feedback. It does not hurt my feelings. I got over getting my feelings hurt about comments and dislikes back like years ago. I really don't care. It doesn't hurt my feelings at all. But, look at this score. It's not super fantastic. Oh my god, I'm level 23 non-prestige. I told you it was the beginning of the, the game for me. I told you I didn't know what I was doing. Level 23, putting in work, 50 and 9. If you're wondering what my stats are, I have a 2.26 KDR. Yeah, I know, not that great, right? But, uh, you know what? I have fun. I goof off in the game. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe if you're new. Peace!